Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Just Parent Things. So today we're going to talk about parenting styles. So I don't know if you guys know, but um, there are actually four different parenting styles based on Google. Okay, so the first is permissive parenting, then you have the authoritarian parenting, neglectful parenting, and the authoritative parenting. Have you all heard of it before? Uh, not today. Not, today. <laughs> not really. I didn't know it's been categorized. Yeah. Like that, I didn't know like gentle parenting. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. So permissive parenting, I would say, I think it is a little bit like gentle parenting mm. where it's very child driven. Mm. So um, there are no clear boundaries and a lot of things is basically whatever the child says goes. Yeah. Mm. yeah and then you have authoritative parenting where it is um, a good, I would say it's a good balance of um, allowing the child to have the space of choice, but you're also setting boundaries and rules. Mm. Yeah. Per se. Mm-hmm. And then you have the authoritarian, which is like, no, whatever I say is go. Um, I'm the parent, you listen to mm-hmm. me. And then, of course, you have neglectful, which is, I, yeah, the, basically it's a, like absent an absent parent. parent. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the parent doesn't really, mm-hmm. uh, is not really involved in the child's um, yeah. needs. But, la. Mine is confirmed permissive parenting. <laughs> really? Yeah. That's like gentle parenting. La. Well, I, I, I wouldn't say I'm a gentle parent, but I, I according to your uh, definition. According to Google. Yeah, according to Google. <laughs> I think I'm permissive. I will spoil them and oh. yeah, yeah. So you're not the disciplinarian in there. Oh no, it's definitely my husband. My husband mm. is a strict one. For me, I'm the kind that uh, one hour already the playground is up ready, and then I will be the uh, do you want to extend? And Brand will say no. Oh. Yeah, and then if the kid uh like if my daughter like uh Fastest, throws a tantrum throws a tantrum yeah I will like okay buy her something on the way out wow. I'm, I'm just like that your Ma- mom yeah, guilt, can I mom be your child can I be your mom can I be your yeah. child <laughs> especially when I bring them out but even at home it's like I'm the always the one like, extending the bed times yeah. so do they throw tantrums like if they want something and then like they um, want to buy something and then they like now more and more my daughter especially she knows what she wants when we go out she will want this want that but I'm like, you can just pick whatever you want. And my what? husband always say no. Always so, say okay, no. So when your husband says no, yeah. then they will uh, get I, angry? Do you always get your way? I will see how strong his no is. Oh. <laughs> if his no is very strong, then I'll be like, okay, then I'll distract them or something. Because they're still very young. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They're easily distracted. Yeah. They're not that smart yet. Yeah. yeah. But I feel when they get older, it'll be harder to distract. So it'll be either a firm yes or a firm no. Law. I think I'm oh. more of um, authoritative. Like, I like to be friends with my children. Mm. Like, we play a lot. But then I still set boundaries. I still set rules. Like, if I say, okay, you get to play iPad half an hour, that means I'll set alarm. Half an hour is done. Then that means yeah. you really got to give me the iPad. Yeah. No matter what you say, you can roll on the floor. I'll still take the yeah. iPad away. <laughs> but then I don't do it like, no, you do not. It's more like, oh, but you promise, right? You know, it's like more of a friend. Yeah. yeah. And then like, for example, like right now it's a Ramadan period, right? So in the morning, we have to wake up like about 5 a.m. to have our mm. pre-dawn meal. Mm. and my two older children they had so difficult it's so difficult to wake them up Mm. in the morning so I saw like this video on Instagram that shows the different types of parents that wakes their children up for for pre-dawn and I'm definitely the friend one so they say the friend one would like go and then sing song to their ear and all that kind of thing so yeah it's very annoying to them but then I think it's a nicer way of uh, you know bonding with your children and not like switching off the icon (laughs) Ah, that's what my parents that's what what my parents that's what the parents one of the mother they go and hit the 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 fan because my mum is the doing it to me so now I hit my kid both me and have to wake up I hate that and then some mums will just like take off the blanket completely you know my gosh <laughs> yeah, so so I'm more. I think I'm more uh, a friend kind of parent. Mm. I prefer that. Yeah, you know that? I think I'm the second. The second one is it? I'm confused with the A's. Is it permissive, authority? Authoritative? authoritative and authoritarian. Oh, so the authoritarian the, is like a our parents one. Yeah, like I'm the parent. Oh, listen to me. Oh, I no, am no, no, your no, no. mother. No, you no, no, no. Listen <laughs> to me. I think I'm the authoritative. Oh. Um, but because Aleria is still very, very, very young, yeah. she is so small. But the thing is, recently she started throwing tantrums. Mm. So when she don't get her way, she starts screaming. And she yeah. screeches. So I, I figured a way to communicate. So I was just Aleria. We discussed this. We didn't. I, I like the friend, but I think as she grows older, my my project or what I want to be is like the, the friend 
part yeah. because like for me I, I want to be able to create a conversative mm. conversative mm. conversative con- environment <laughs> con- 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 conversational conversational environment yeah. yes conversational <laughs> yeah but like an environment for her to communicate yeah I would say I'm the yeah, but I'm not too strict also, and I'm not the kind of spoiled because yeah. like yeah I'm just more I think being a parent you just have to be smart because I'm very particular about screen time mm. so I will when they, they they will never ask for me but if they do ask for me I will just say oh no let's read a book instead I will always distract mm-hmm. them with something just have to be smarter at it yeah. but if they really cannot and they insist let's say we are out I'll let them watch like animal videos instead of YouTube educational yeah, right yeah, educational yeah. or yeah. like I'll show them things I'll show them like videos of them playing just now yeah, 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 instead yeah. of like mm. just playing YouTube yeah, so yeah. And, and, and to leave them on their own that's the most dangerous yeah. actually yeah. Right, like right. even if you are letting them have some screen time it's mm. better if you are there with them mm. watching it together so that you can talk yeah. about it you get me? yeah mm. How about you? I think for me I don't have a parenting style eh? I feel mm. like I switch between parenting styles based on my mood my patience yeah. and yeah because like I, I do so much and I have so much going on like yeah. sometimes I have no patience mm. and I become the authoritarian where yeah. like I don't have time for this to you explain gotta, yeah you gotta listen yeah, to me yeah. then you'll be like why am I why I can't I cannot have five minutes more like yeah. because I say so can you yeah. just get yeah. it done right now you know and then sometimes I'm like okay um, I feel guilty mm. like you know let's let's try a different approach try to talk to them nicely and then you talk to them nicely once they don't listen you yeah. talk to them nicely twice they don't twice then that's when I snap you, you become know? the biggest yeah. one yeah or like sometimes like I I have things to do at home mm. and they need me mm-hmm. and I cannot be there and then yeah. you know I am unintentionally that neglectful parent yeah, 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 I'm yeah, like yeah, can yeah. y'all go and figure out how to do this yeah, first yeah, 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 yeah. actually we do sway yeah. from yeah. one yeah. parenting style mm. to another it depends yeah. on the situation yeah. you know? yeah. and patience level and how tired you are how occupied you are what other exactly. important thing is going on at that moment yeah. when they are yeah. needing your Correct. attention yep. yeah. yeah and I think it differs from kids child to child mm. so because all, so, all yes. my kids are very different definitely yeah, yeah. my uh, my eldest one she when she was young she was very sensible from the start yeah, I correct, speak correct, to her mm. first child like always like that now. yeah, yeah oh. I, I can be that let's friend. stop there <laughs> <laughs> it, 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 it doesn't work if you only have one kid one kid is single child syndrome uh, you need to have a sibling and then you to be the, the older oh, one oh goodness yeah. <laughs> but like my first child was super easy yeah. I can discipline her I can talk to her nicely make her understand yeah, yeah. second one I tried the same thing it didn't work at all same, same, yeah. Same. yeah so it got so bad right that I actually had to with my second one I had to call um, I have to go and search MSF and mm. like see what are the help I could get to try and like do something about to fix this situation because I was coming home every day and screaming at her she was, yeah. she would be screaming and crying she don't want to bathe and I was, I'll be trying to eat dinner and it will go on for like 2-3 hours yeah. just screaming and crying and screaming oh. and crying wait how old is your second one? now she's 9 yeah. so it's better but this was when she was 3 and because mm. yeah <laughs> Yeah. It's coming, it's coming. Oh, and no, you just have to be smart one. My kids also go through uh, the one to bathe yeah. thing. Yeah. So, and it, it got bad because I was living with my parents. So my parents, you know, grandparents, they will give they will, so they will go yeah. out. So they yeah. are extremely yeah. permissive. Oh my point. gosh. Yeah. 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 So, Theirs is bad. Theirs is permissive with no boundaries. Yeah, so yeah. then when, then when it was us, oh, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Okay, we'll get to that later. Yeah, yeah, it was so bad that when I try to discipline my second one and I carry her to try and like put her in a corner, right? Yeah. My mom would snatch her out of my hands and say like, oh no, you know, don't score her. You know, that kind of thing. That's very serious. Yeah. You have two different parenting. Yeah. So then styles. when I moved out and, and and was living on my own with my mm. kids I had to correct that behaviour yeah, yeah, where yeah. she oh, gets yeah. what she wants. That's a lot wants. of work. Yeah. <laughs> it's then, like double work. Yeah, it was so bad that um then I I had this consultation with a uh, with a uh, child therapist yeah. basically too. What is the MS? Uh, Ministry of yeah. Soci- Social so- and Family something oh, is it? Okay. Is it? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They have free programs apparently. Oh, okay. <laughs> this is a oh, plug. Okay. But yeah, okay. so I, I was so desperate. So there's this thing called okay because I went through um my child has a, a learning disability yeah. line, so she uh, she saw a psychiatrist mm. and then they also recommended this program called the Triple P, P program. Okay. So they have like group sessions or face-to-face session, but for me I had the one one hour per week for three weeks call to basically teach me how to be a better parent yeah. to my child or how to mm-hmm. how to parent my child, how to mm-hmm. discipline my child. Yeah. So it it she, she it told useful? me 
Yeah, it was. So she told me, okay, mommy, whatever you're doing right now, it sounds great. It sounds like you're doing all the right things, but you just have to be more firm. You just have to be more stubborn than yeah. her. Oh. Yeah, and oh. let her know that wow. no matter how she cries, no matter what she yeah. does, she cannot negotiate with you and you are in charge. And right. it works? Yeah, it works. So It's like training a dog. Yeah, so right. the first week oh. it happened, I had friends over for dinner. Yeah. The whole time she was screaming, crying, kicking, on the floor mm. and this was when she was six already mm. in front of my friends while we were having dinner so I told my friend I'm so sorry but I just have to let this happen you just have to be there Yeah. tell her one time no whatever it is no and then just be there let her scream and cry but don't walk away mm. so like for three hours she was screaming crying until she realised okay no matter what I do I'm, I'm not going to get my yeah. what I want so from then on right she so when I'm, I'm, yeah, so, when I, so after that Whenever she screams and cry and I say, Megan, don't negotiate with me, she'll be like, fine. And then she will go. Yeah. So it becomes shorter and shorter. Yes, the correct. Wow. Yeah. So I learned a lot. Yeah, that's a good tip. Yeah. It is. Yeah. Yeah. You guys are scaring me to the <laughs> <laughs> So Kiki, you've got two, mm. two kids, right? So is it different? Like when one gets screen time, one gets screen time too? Or how, how does that work? Uh, I try to deal with them separately. But if they're both together and I'm with the both of them, no means no, like they cannot get. If they do get, I always have only one phone and I'm holding it, controlling what's mm. showing and they both share. They cannot have their own. But then previously, my helper or I don't know who like, in the house used to give them yeah. one gadget oh. each. And they know how to swipe. Yeah. If I give them my phone unlocked, they know how to get to the app. They know how to wow. choose yeah. and they, they can choose any show they want and they can get to the kind of shows they want to get, which I don't even know how. Oh, I YouTube. think that's something to do with like it's the caretaking. Scary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Caretaking. So think, now I'm like really putting my foot down and mm. saying no, cannot. Cannot have screen time. Yeah, I think Both it's very difficult cannot. also when you are always not at home. Yeah, yeah, And then yeah, you yeah, leave yeah. the care yeah. to so like does it work? Well, I actually want to ask you because you're mm. very busy. Yeah. So like who spends time with them at home and who... At home is the helpers. Okay. At home, so sometimes with my in-laws also. So when the helpers yeah. are with them, like mm. you tell the helpers what to do with the children? I'm not so micromanaged but then... I will tell them no screen time, no screen time. I'll give them all the books, all the toys and say, please do this, please do this, please do this, like that. As long as there's yeah. no screen time, do whatever yeah, 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 you want. Yeah. But I'm sure once in a while, they will still give when they are like out of control, which I don't mind. Yeah, yeah. I'm not like, wow, watch the CCTV and make yeah. sure I don't mm -hmm, have. Right, but yeah. as long as I can see, mm -hmm. I will say no, no screen mm -hmm. time. But I won't be like so strict and then go and like scold the helper. I will just pull them out mm -hmm. to my room and then in my room or when they go out with us, they will never ask for phone. Mm. Yeah, but with my in-laws and my, the helpers, yeah. they will always ask for phone yes. because they, they know who yeah. they can get it yeah, from. Yeah, right? Actually, it's the opposite for me. Eh. Huh? Yeah, and actually, you know, yeah, the screen the, time thing yeah. is something that I wanted to ask you, mummies. Mm -hmm. Like, when do you start giving your kids screen time? Because now Elaria right, mm. is at an age where she knows how to on the TV. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She oh, press the on. Fast. Yeah, she pressed what? the on and then she would somehow click, click, click and it ends up at a Miss Rachel. Because I always put Miss Rachel at singing least in Miss the background. I think Miss Rachel is at least Because I heard of the... Uh, the slow development thing yeah, when yeah, you watch yeah. other my son my son was given a uh, phone at four uh, four months phone? Four, yeah given screen time at four months old and I, months I had to old. stop yeah oh my. I had to stop there and say hey, his eyesight is not even developed yet but it's very 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 difficult because they have their own way of parenting yeah. I have my own way of parenting and it's hard to enforce when you're all living together Mm, my yeah. mom though like is the opposite of me so mm. I am the one who is like um, I let her hear Miss Rachel in the background mm. but my mom is strictly no phone so because yeah. most of the time Elaria is in Malaysia and I go back to Malaysia that's great and see her. Yeah. she's mm. with my mom and dad but the thing is my mom and dad they are retired they are mm. completely bored they yeah. have nothing much Aww. to do so all their time is with Elaria but my dad is the one that's Boils her rotten. When she cried through attention, no, she poor thing. She expressing herself. Yes, oh, and sometimes like I, that. I will be there because most of the like time that. I'm there. I'm like, excuse me. Yes. Mm. Excuse me. What did I just yeah. see? He said, no, Cheryl. This is yeah. This poor thing. Wow, my she dad cannot my express dad herself. My dad recently had a spare phone. He went to buy SIM card to give my second one. Like to use I was so mad yeah, yeah, yeah. And because my second one she, She's always Like mm. Or she had a history Of throwing temp tantrums When oh. screen time Is taken away mm. from yeah. her Yeah so I didn't used to Be so Anal about Screen time mm. I used to be Very laxed 
like sh- they can because I'm not home so they yeah, watch yeah, yeah. TV like right, the right. entire yeah, yeah. day yeah. but oh, then it I drives me nuts uh, this thing I yeah. hate it when they give yeah. like, is it okay yeah. like screen time like what do you mummies think like uh, what do you think in moderation tops yeah. an hour a day but, but how old to start then? no I think too young one year old I mean yeah. if you read right um children are not supposed to be wa- uh, watching have any screen time at all until they turn five and above so did you enforce it like with uh, your yes, I did. So my first two children totally no screen time. Yeah, and you see your your kid will go yeah. to school, right? So I mean, yeah, really, I had no screen time also. I could only watch yeah, Saturday no one hour, okay? Mm. Oh yeah, Care Bears and My Little Pony. Our yeah. time. And, and I have to choose oh, what yeah, they yeah. can watch. Right? And I have to wake up last time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Last because time it's not like on demand. Yeah, yeah, you have to watch yeah. yeah correct. Time. Last yeah. time it was like all like certain timings yeah. that yeah. we can watch. Yeah. But now it's like Netflix. Netflix. Yeah. yeah. So you can get it anytime yeah. they want. Okay, but like screen time, right? Because mm. I am I, I'm new to this. So yeah. I only recently discovered that um kids okay, this is what the doctor told me when Elaria mm. got her vaccination. He told me actually when kids are want to start screen time it's above 18 months that is the mm. suggested like okay like last time it's 2 years then they yeah. brought it down to 6 months I mean uh, 18, 18 months but mm. with 18 months they also said certain programs cannot so highly it's called highly functioning videos it's not mm. okay it's Over those stimulation yes it's stimulation. those yeah. like Coco, slow melon more uh, singing more what the same Miss Rachel yeah, he told me it's okay. good but I always wanted to ask like what's so bad about screen time it's, it's just because I'm curious like what's so bad about my screen? son at, at, is, yeah, it will affect mm. their development, development. my yeah. son at, he's almost 4 he can only say single words. I think the attention span join. as well yeah. because the images is like Very constantly fast. Yeah, and I changing. hate it right when they have the phone and you talk to them they are not there. It's like their soul is completely gone. Yes. I really hate that it. That is so true. They are so into it nothing matters yeah. in the world you know. It's very bad but I mean I, I we are on our phones all the time. I mean I'm mostly working but they also watch us yeah, yes. so it's like a bit hypocritical that mm. you know I make them read books play mm. games mm. and I'm on there on the phone. Mm. So, I think yeah. you have to set rules. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Um, I have a rule where when we are eating, nobody can use the phone. Yeah. yeah so oh like, we are God. all... Oh, my kid will use that against me. Yeah, because <laughs> I, 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 I myself don't do it, you see. Uh-huh. So they have no excuse to like... Oh God, I love that. Phone. Yeah, like family bonding time. Yeah, I mean like, stop. nowadays, right, it's so difficult to even... I mean, my I have a 14-year-old and then I have a 12-year-old. They are so big with it and they have their own things to do every yeah, day, yeah. schoolwork and everything. And that's the only time where we can actually really sit down and spend time mm-hmm. and talk mm-hmm. and ask about their day, right? So I think it's so important for us to even to show that even we, as busy as I am on Instagram, I have yeah. to put my phone down yeah. and just talk to my children. Well, what you mentioned, what you asked earlier, I did uh, stumble across some articles and videos that link ADHD, ADHD yeah. to too much screen time. Correct, correct. Yeah. correct. I really mm. believe Because they are always simul- is o- always overstimulated yeah. Yeah. that they constantly need that yeah. 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 If not, and everything else is slow to them, mm. so that's the only one that and excites boring. them. Yeah. Yeah. You are boring. You are slow. Yeah. yeah because that's yeah. more interesting. Mm. So when you take that away from them, they will throw a tantrum because yeah. yeah. nothing is good enough. Yeah. So, yeah. But yeah. I think with yeah. older yeah. kids, right, mm. it's a bit more difficult to enforce it because if you're not at home and then older kids, they know how to turn on the TV and everything. Yeah. 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 I so, mean, our teenagers, right? Yeah. yeah. So my new house will not have a TV. Oh really? Yes. Yeah. 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 Wow. We will not have a TV. How, how about I you? Mean, you don't watch TV? I don't watch TV. You have no time to watch TV. I, 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 I don't like Netflix. I don't like TV. I find it very tiring. I just, I mean, the most I do is like TikTok. No mm. wonder you don't know me. <laughs> 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 but, but how do you manage it then? How so, you- okay. So, my, my teenagers, right? Mm. My children, uh, my son only gets a phone uh, when he turned 12. Mm-hmm. 12 years Mine old also about that 11 yeah, Guys because I wanted PSLE. to give my daughter one at 16 Do not, oh, 16 but everybody yeah. say that like I got she'll be 18 some, years like, old but I think our time different because time when different. I gave my yeah. daughter her phone at 11 her friends all around her already had phones yeah, yeah that's why yeah, yeah, I yeah. four already no my, my, my children all their friends at primary 2 already yeah. having their own yeah. phone yeah. I think it's not permissive yeah. right? you're quite authoritative I feel no only on screen time but everything else, I am permissive. Mm. I don't en- enforce anything like, we must eat, finish, then you can go. Uh, I'm not like that. But then, so talking about that, right? So my children, my uh, only my son now, he's got his own phone. Yeah. La. Mm-hmm. My daughter is 12, but she still don't get her phone because she's a bit different. Mm-hmm. <laughs> the second yeah, child. Yeah, second the child, child. I tell you always problem. The middle so child. I'm delaying her, you know, getting yeah. her a phone. Yeah, like, yeah. Maybe next year la, when she goes to secondary school. But even though my son have a phone, right? He, he, I have, Screen time for him so I can monitor everything. You know, your phone all has yeah, that yeah. screen time thing where you can. I'll probably do that. Yeah, I'll so do that you can even phone. tick which apps you want him to be able to use yeah, all day. Yeah, yeah. Is this iPhone? Yeah. 
I think Android also got this now. Parental and then you can control. See, yeah, parental like control. Yeah, so you can set the time, what yeah. time is totally close off. You can give like uh-huh. one minute of gameplay, yeah. <laughs> one minute uh-huh. of YouTube. Uh, okay. <laughs> so once it's done, they get locked uh-huh. out. Yeah, mm-hmm. They can ask for permission from you and then you'll get, you know, and you, yeah. get, you get everything. You can see everything mm-hmm. that he's doing on the phone. Uh-huh. Yeah. Um, when, my, when my kid was like much younger, I think maybe about seven, uh, mm. um, then she used, I think she had an iPad. And then, because when you play certain games, you get served ads, right? Oh. And then there was an ad where it was a game about like role-playing. So I still remember it's called like chapters or something. But you know, it's like cartoon. Yeah. There's oh, like the guy. Yes, one, right? Correct. Those sexual stories. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like and then, romance kind yeah, of thing. And then so, at that oh my God. point of time, I think we weren't like, using the parental controls mm-hmm. where, you know, she can download any app she wants. Yeah, then she started playing there and then I found out. So, yeah. But I had a talk with her. Yeah. Oh my. And, yeah. Seven is very young. Oh, uh, so, like, I just told her, like, you, why are you hiding this yeah. uh, from me? You know it's mm-hmm. bad, right? That's why you're hiding it from me. Mm-hmm. So, if you know it's bad, then don't, don't do it. This is not, um, a, a good game lah. Yeah. Yeah, and then she understood lah. Mm. I mean, Kylie being Kylie, yeah. um, she's the more sensible one. Yeah. She's like a grown up in a little yeah. point. But my second one, I have an issue with her and YouTube. Mm. The things she watches is very dark. It's also cartoon stuff. Yeah. But like what? But like, it will say like, oh, I will unalive you. Yeah. That kind of like, those um, gacha. I mean, mm. gacha, where it's like animated characters yeah. talking to each other and then mm. it's very, it's very weird. Yeah, so I keep, I, I, like restrict access so you know mm-hmm. certain content doesn't mm-hmm. come out but then it still does I delete the app it keeps appearing oh and my. like she will go to do I have YouTube app right mm. use Safari lah oh no. my god oh no <laughs> what nonsense yeah so like, that's why when you mention oh you can set yeah, right? yeah, yeah, I think yeah. I need to dive deeper into that yeah, yeah I, 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 so, I just want to do that really yeah, it's so yeah. easy yeah. You know, like back in the day, right? Recently, okay, this is a bit unrelated, but mm. remember back in the day, we used to watch like those big TV programs and then we used to watch like different shows at like 7.30, 6.30. Mm-hmm. But what I've discovered recently and why I will not be letting my daughter watch mm. these kind of shows, especially by big produced companies, yeah. um, is because I feel that there's a lot of child instigating on like sex um, and there's a lot of instigation on like pornography in this, you know. Like if you really go and watch back all like the... Like the subliminal messages. Yes, oh. like back in the day. And I think YouTube has a lot of it now mm-hmm. also because mm-hmm. as much as people create child content, that's why for me like... I, it's like all these new fears unlocked. Now I'm hearing... Because YouTube, I don't... I think you can do parental access but at mm-hmm. the same time, a lot of creators that create as well that put on YouTube, they have a lot of subliminal messages and, and it's like... It's like really loopholes. Really, yeah. 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 And, and it's like scary, you know, because mm. I actually experienced something about a scary thing which mm. is like it manifested. So I had this one little girl that I met and she always talked to me about like the purge and she would talk to me about like you know like scary things and she's mm. I asked her what's your favorite movie she said like oh some exorcism and I was just <gasps> like how, was old, like, how old are you? Yeah. Yeah. and at the time I think she was 6, 7 mm. yeah and, and so she, she was always like I was looking at iPad sometimes it would just be this strange like horror things yeah, you yeah, know yeah, and, yeah, and for me like that is strange as a mom that is mm. strange if I saw my daughter doing that like that is strange mm. like that is not that's why it's most important is we must have a friendship uh, communication oh. with your oh. children. I feel mm. like when you are friend friend with them, uh, they will tend to tell you everything. Mm. <laughs> oh, that I agree. Yeah, that I they agree. do. You know, like I think I'm I'm pretty glad that I have that kind of a uh, relationship with my children mm. because they tell me everything. Like my daughter, she is uh, twelve this year, right? So this year they had some Chung Cheng Hai boys came to their school to mm. do some performance, wushu performance. Uh. Yeah. She came back home, the moment she got into my car, she was like, Mommy, I met such a cute guy. <laughs> oh, and I was so like, cute. Whoa, I said, how cute? Then she said, he looks like this K-pop idol. Ayoh. He's so cute. You got what I mean? So that's what you want with your children yeah, to yeah. tell, to get excited, yeah. to tell you things. So and we, we don't want to be those kind of parents we're like, they what are you talking about you. Boy, boys? You know, you're yeah. still so young. That kind of thing, you know? You want to like, channel that friendship mm-hmm. thing yeah. with your children and that's when I think they will build the trust to tell you everything because yeah. my parents sorry give me like a moment I need to cough I hope for them long. <laughs> yeah but yeah, having yeah. one style doesn't mean that if it, this works for my kid doesn't mean that it will work for your yeah. kid because they're all different characters yeah, also yeah. Yeah. yeah sometimes even if you put throw them in the harshest environment or the best environment yes. they might still turn out to be a criminal and so my dog yes. and, yeah. Yeah. And, yeah. and every child is different so I remember 
um, watching TikTok like this um, psychologist who mm. studies like the human brain and all, he was saying that no two children, um, even if they are from the same parents, they don't have the same parents. Yeah. You know, because your people change, right? Mm. And the first child you have them at like a certain age, yeah. Mm. Yeah, and yeah. then you your your environment is different. Your job might be might be mm. different. You know, your circumstances might dif- be, might be different. So even though they come from the same parent, yeah. No two child has the same parents. Which is very interesting. Yeah. Yeah. Now that you really think about it. Yeah. Yeah. I also want to ask Kiki. Mm. So, ha- like when you and Brand, because both your parenting styles are so different, yeah, right? Yeah, because our family upbringing. Yeah. yeah. And then he's more of the authoritative one or yeah. a, and you're the more permissive one, mm. right? Mm. So then do, do you all fight about your parenting styles? Do you all fight in front of the kids about it? Or how? Actually, our values are the same. It's just that the, mm. the main difference I see is that... Uh, both our parents are very strict. So that's the same. But he uh, carries on what he mm. was, how he was brought up. But I'm trying to break that. Uh. Yeah. So, and then the only difference I can see is that his parents allow screen time, my parents don't allow screen time. So this is one very big fight that we had because I have to tell him, can you tell your parents not to let, give them screen time, mm. blah, 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 blah. But he, because he himself doesn't see um, as big of a problem, he doesn't understand like what was yeah. discussed here. So, he also very difficult because he's in the middle. Mm-hmm. So yeah, we, we don't really fight, fight. But sometimes I get very frustrated because, you know, I know it's bad for them. Yeah, yeah so he's, in a, he's in a very difficult position. Yeah, he's he like is, in the middle. That's his yeah, parents and that's his wife. I, but like, I fully acknowledge that. Yeah. So I try not to. So it, sometimes I don't tell him. I just tell the helpers because right. they are the direct access uh. to their children. So that is my way of navigating. But let's yeah. say like if you want to buy things for mm. like your kids, right? And he's like, no. Uh, <laughs> between me and Brent, I, I know how it seems like to the public, but between me and my husband, he always gets the last say, especially if it's strong enough. And he all he's always very firm. Like, no, mm. put it back, let's go. That'll be like the child. Also. <laughs> like the third child. I'm like, oh, okay, yes, papa. Okay. But, but you guys have never like, mm. you know, you, you tell him like, why cannot? Like, why just uh, let her no, no, not I, in front of the kids? I am smart. You need to be smart about it. He <laughs> says, no, no, it's okay. I can go to like Shopee or like that and then buy <laughs> oh it later. Oh, yeah. Uh, or like, I have a lot of ways around it. Like, I would like, let's say it's like upcoming birthday. I'll just tell my girlfriend, can you get this? Then why he get angry? Like after it's that? It's a gift to what? <laughs> it's a gift why not I didn't buy it no one I didn't that's buy very it. smart that is I very smart I yeah. think we need to yeah. block brand from the podcast <laughs> is there a way to restrict brand no he knows la. but okay but what if it's not gift like maybe like example uh, mm. playground time like you said just now uh, right <coughs> playground time my way of is the permissive way I will spoil them by either distracting or bringing them to a shop bringing them to see other things but he's like no but then I find that with them if I do that, I could do that. Yeah. But if I do that, the tantrum is even bigger and it can they are like inconsolable. So if so if he does that yeah. and they show tantrum, yeah. then do you step in and say, I, I step in and I distract, but I don't um you don't undermine his him. way. Yeah. I don't undermine his way, yeah. Because it's very bad. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't and don't do yeah, it in, yeah. Front, yeah. in front of the children. Yeah, yeah. I, would, I would distract them because yeah. they're still young. Yeah, yeah, My yeah, mind yeah. is different because they're still young. It's not like Kylie and Megan's age. Yeah. 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 No, they but are I still easily distracted. When yeah, when they're older, so it's good to take whatever disagreements you have mm. like behind privately yes, yeah privately yes, yes, yes. not in front of the kids if not it will confuse like mm. them or like and I also think that it's very important to have um, private conversations with your children especially if you have multiple um, children Care right a few mm. children right you need to be able to spend time alone with them yes that is so that. important mm. like when I spend time alone with my children, that's when I find out a lot more things mm. about them. Because usually, because I have a younger one, right? And she's very, oh yeah, she's noisy lah. Mm. You know? So, she, because when, when she's around, when we, whenever we go out, she gets the most yeah. attention. Mm. So, you tend to forget the other two. Yeah, I tend to forget yeah. the other two. So, I like to spend time alone with them. I'll take them out, go for lunch mm. or whatever, just, a, yeah. just coffee or whatever, you know, and then just have a conversation with yeah. them. And one more thing that's very important, I feel, is also... Um, acknowledging your mistakes yes. and apologizing mm. yes. to your children. Mm. This is so important because I think sometimes we think that, oh no, we are parents, we are always right, yeah. you know, or, or if you make a us. mistake. Not for us yet. Huh? Not for us Not yet. Not for you guys. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's how I'm listening. Yeah. 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 Because ours yeah. are big already, yeah. right? Yeah. 
So I realise that when I make a mistake, for example, if I scold my daughter for something that she didn't do, yeah. or you know, it's something so minor and I like lost my temper, you know, mm. I will actually come back to her later yeah. and apologise. Yeah. And I really will say, I'm really sorry. I don't know what happened to yeah. me. You know, I, I, was, I shouldn't have done yeah. that. You know, mm. you really got a really go down low yeah. even though they are your children I feel that like it's important when you do that okay. and then they will respect you more yeah. actually so they really wealth will wealth of experience yeah. Yeah. so yeah. sometimes learn. Yeah. sometimes my husband can get very harsh when mm. he's disciplining the kids and then after he's done you know I will tell him okay you shouldn't have done this you yeah, should have yeah, said yeah. this yeah. you know and then he will digest it the next day he will go to our kids that's and apologize really nice. that's, that's very nice. nice that's so important yeah. and about the one on one time thing yeah. I struggle with that a lot because I'm so busy I'm always like want to maximize everybody let's bring um, everybody yeah, out but yeah. my husband does it very well he will take the the kids um out one on one go for dinners and I all. do that too one, the one by one yeah. 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 I and think I always very tell them oh, I have a secret to tell you Coco doesn't know Mom, uh, Mimi doesn't know I will just tell them like and give them something special make them yeah. feel special yeah, it's okay. yeah and I will bring them out one by one also yeah. it is very different when you go out with them one by it one is, as is. opposed to even with Bren and bring two kids out they're just distracted yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. correct and, and when you bring them out one by one they're so well behaved yeah, <laughs> yeah, right. yeah. so well behaved very yeah, easy like but when the Coco yeah when the Coco or Mimi is there wow, yeah. it becomes like less two hectic monsters hectic la, yeah, you know yeah. you it's have a really lot of mind. time with that mm. particular child Alright, we've come to the end of part one of this episode. So join us for part two. Stay tuned.